The lights are on! Coronavirus! Coronavirus! Ooh, today is the day we are going back to a Disney park. So, okay, all the Disney parks in the United States have been closed for the past four months. We're going to Magic Kingdom today. We're gonna to be one of the first people ever to be back for the new grand reopening of Magic Kingdom. The castle they've been working on is fully repainted. I'm excited. Okay, so they started letting people in at eight o'clock. We should be able to get there by nine o'clock. I'm so excited. I hope you guys are too. Let's go. Okay, so currently what's going on is We've been sitting here for like over 20 minutes just waiting to get through the, the toll booth. They're only allowing a certain amount of cars in at a time. Okay, we're probably going to wait another 20 minutes. Uh, we're we're the next people to go through. Classic. The problem right now is your boy's Crohn's is calling and he's got to go. And now I'm stressing, if you know what I mean. <laughs> We've made it to the toll plaza. It's been like 40 minutes now. <laughs> now we get to wait in like another line. The traffic is now up to the bridge. Oh my god. This is literally, not only now can you wait in line in the park, you can now wait in line outside of the park. Okay, so it took almost an hour to get to the bathroom, but <laughs> I'm feeling better. It's time to get our temperature screening now. You're good to go. Oh, thank you so much. All of our electronics in one bag. All right, so we just got out of uh, security. Anything metal has to kind of go into this plastic bag. Even, they said apparently even my umbrella has to go into the plastic bag. Anything that's electronic. Okay, monorail is backed up. It looks like they have different social distancing numbers to get to the line to the monorail. You know, let's just take the ferry boat. I'm glad they have a poster for the greatest movie ever made. Okay, so the ferry boat, we have the markers all the way back here. The ferry is full, so now we're waiting on our little marker. For the next one. Okay, our first Disney ride of the day. So it looks like they put us into two separate groups. A group that goes upstairs and a group that goes downstairs. For your safety not available, I guess you can just sit there. Dom, are you sure you don't want to go back to work? We see Magic Kingdom. All right, so before we get our tickets scanned, they have the social distancing markers leading up. Main Street, there's not too many people out. It's, it feels different coming down Main Street, but there's the new castle. I don't know how I feel about the new paint job yet. Now, before, we, when we were looking at the castle from far away, uh, we thought it was really hideous. It looked like a little Barbie doll castle, but seeing it up close in person, it's not that bad. So they said there wasn't gonna be a parade, but they're having, I guess, one float come at a time, come through the park. Right, they have safety signs on the trash can. They got places to wash your hands. Look how slow the walkway is to Tomorrowland. And this is the other walkway to Tomorrowland, literally just dead, no one here. There are more cast members than guests in this walkway. It looks like Monsters Inc. Laugh Floor is closed. Looks like they repainted a new wall. Now, we were all talking about like, what's the first ride that we're gonna ride when we get back to Magic Kingdom? And we all wanna do the People Mover. And uh, I think the people mover is down. The Tomorrowland Transit Authority people mover is not operating at this time. Okay, it's time for our first ride back. We're gonna be doing Space Mountain. It's a five minute wait. They have hand sanitizer before you get in the queue. So they have the queue markers all the way through the entire queue. So the line currently goes all the way back to kind of where they used to have the games that you would play in the queue. So for this side, it looks like they've installed plexiglass on the switchback. Starting to get excited. I miss my Space Mountain. Oh. The lights are on! Um, let's hope. <laughs> oh, we just finished. My body was not prepared for that. They gave us our own car together. I was just confused. So if you're worried about sharing with another party, you're just there alone. We're in the gift shop. I don't hear any music. It's just like dead silence. <laughs> Dom has been tempted to buy a new magic band. He has a problem. Teach us the way, Dom. Why is this so special? Because I have a problem and mm -hmm. I have brought dishonor to, upon my family. Open it up. I'm not going to open it up. Well, why not? You got to see what it looks it. like. I can't see what it looks like right here. Perfectly Let's fine. Don't touch it. Don't it up. Don't you dare touch it. <laughs> Coronavirus. Don't Dom, we it. live together. So? Okay, all right. So the there's Mulan right there. Ba Mulan with her little comb. I would say the park doesn't even feel like an after hours event. It just feels more eerie. It's just, it's odd. They're finally using the stage. It looks like 
that's how you can do your meet and greet with Buzz with a social distance selfie. Now, throughout the day, everything's kind of getting a little slower and slower because I think people are leaving. There's just nobody sitting outside. There's normally a, a huge line outside Buzz, and there's, it's probably a walk-on. Was it? A five minute wait. Right, time for some Buzz Lightyear Space Ranger spin. They don't have the Buzz animatronic running. Wait, didn't, didn't we used to enter there? At Universal, before you go on every single ride, the uh, team members put hand sanitizer in your hands. At Disney, it's optional. So on a ride like Buzz, it's optional to put on hand sanitizer before a ride. I kind of like where a team member always puts it in my hand. I am a little sad right now. I was really looking forward to eating a Cheshire cattail, but it looks like they're closed. It's like a little paint by number, I guess. What shade of gray they have to use. Let's look. <laughs> You're normally just shoulder to shoulder with everyone here at Fantasyland. They still have Liberty Tree Tavern if you want to get something to eat. Frontier Trader Post. Closed. They have the whole shooting gallery turned off. I don't even see any of the guns there. They've completely removed all the guns. When you see stuff like that, it kind of does make you feel like things are normal here. Well, it's time to ride the wildest ride in the wilderness. So, again, it looks like they have plexiglass set up throughout all the queues. So I'm looking like Merida from Festival of the Fantasy with, her, with the elbows right there. Yeah! It looks like some of the interactive queue elements have been turned off. They've removed the handles all together. The little spinning images. That man has a hat of the new castle. They're kind of tight quarters. I think if you were a larger person, you might have trouble getting through here. It feels like we're in like a jail or something. Yeah, no. Let's ride in the wilderness. Oh, here we go. than I remember. Lame. I'm used to being like hurt and jerked around. It's really smooth. Now, Dom had a good point. The reason it felt slower is because there's like half the people are in the trains. Time Lisa to sanitize up. Wait, so how long did it take to make? This one took a month. A month? Yeah. Okay, it's worth it. Just because you had to figure out how at the same time as doing it, you know? Yeah. Have you had struggles today? I saw you hit your head. I just did, yeah. I'm glad you didn't get that on film. No, I didn't. <laughs> it looks great. That's I love it. All right, it's time to do Jungle Cruise. And I know Allison isn't here. She's in Texas. She'll be here soon. She's flying back in a couple days. But they have removed the fast pass sign altogether. Well, Jared, does that look like the Mary Poppins bag Air, up there? Belgium, oh, shit. Yeah, it kind of does. Some bad news. Jungle Cruise went 101. I think the Jungle Cruise gods were against us today because they didn't want us riding it without Allison. We are inside now. It's time to see one of a Walt Disney World classic attractions, the Carousel of Progress. I'm sure you already know by the, by the sound of the music. So there's a great big beautiful tomorrow shining at the end of every day. It's not a toy, you know. Ooh la la! So that's little Egypt doing the hoochie coochie, eh, Dad? <laughs> Isn't she a knockout? She's the star of the New World's Fair in St. Louis, and, <clears throat> and you put that away before your mother finds it. I'm indecent. <laughs> Don't worry, Patricia. They're friends. 
That's our teenage daughter. She's getting ready to go to a Valentine's dance across town on one of those new horseless trolleys. I think it's very romantic you're taking Mother out for Valentine's dinner this evening. Well, you know what kind of sport I am. I only hope I have an evening as romantic as yours and Mother's. There's a great big beautiful tomorrow shining at the end of every day. There's a great big beautiful Yeah, the music tomorrow. isn't playing. It's kind of weird. It's a dream come true for you and me. So there's a great big beautiful tomorrow. And we've got a house full of new electrical servants. Mr. Edison sure added life to our home. Are you awake, dears? <laughs> Give him a left, you big lug. You hear that? My daughter Patty is using that old exercise machine. Oh, Patty, are you going to the Halloween party tonight? Yes, and I'm hoping to lose a few more inches by then since I'm going with that dreamboat, Wilfred. Wilfred? What a slug! He's coming as the headless horseman. <laughs> it fits. Come on, Beth. That Claude Hopper Howard you're going with is no Cracker Jack prize. Oh, poor Howard. I wonder what they said about me when I was dating Sarah. He follows his dream with my heart. And when it becomes a reality, Tomorrow? That's right, you're gonna have to wait for part two tomorrow. I'm sorry guys, I filmed like an hour of footage. Currently, as you guys are watching right now, Dom and I are gonna be at DAC, so let me know down in the comments what you guys want us to do at DAC. If you guys enjoyed our preview video of Magic Kingdom, make sure to show the video some love, hit that like button, and if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe so you get notified every single time I post one of my crazy Disney adventures. I love you all. I'm so excited for you guys to see part two and DAC. Like, the next like two weeks of videos are just gonna be madness. Okay, please stay safe, and I will see you all very soon. The Ducks of Disney must be so confused that why are all their guests here now?